helps mitigate hatred. And uh, Yachi is very grateful. And uh, okay, I, we really hope that uh, this book can be published in China. Okay. And now let's you know have our like a uh, wonderful like a uh, guest there. Okay. And uh, they are superstars, right? And uh, this pastor, this pastor is composed by our team. Okay, and we have uh, like uh, volunteers from Suji performing artists there, and uh, we also have Chen Jiazhi. Okay, serves as the like a graphic designer here, and Lin Nanhua is an actress, and uh, this is not uh, her only time coming to Kaohsiung. And in online study group Kaohsiung, and we have like director and uh, actor actress coming here to deliver the message that okay, bone marrow donation actually is not that terrifying. Okay, and uh, don't trust the rumor that they will just do something on the spine. Okay, and uh, we just have the director and uh, our actor actress coming here alone last year, and uh, he says that. They are like、uh, Yang Ziyi and Lin Nanhua, and、uh, in the film they are the grandma and the grandson. Okay, and I can't just do the bone marrow donation, but I can hear and promote this kind of good idea, and、uh, I have promoted this idea to many friends. Right? Okay, as long as we have an、like, embassy, and within Suji. I think you can have a lot of identification because then you can do more than one thing. Okay, right. Okay, and in Lunar July, which is auspicious month, right? And then Lin Nanhua also promotes the vegetarianism. And in the past,、uh, I just can't survive without meat, right? You can be a vegetarian, but a vegetarian doesn't mean that you can only eat like a pickles and、uh, like 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 a tofu, right? Not that easy, right? So this is kind of an outdoor promotion of a vegetarianism, and、uh, Lin Nanhua is like、uh, working so hard and、uh, speaking so happily there. And now we also have Liang Bilan, who is also a singer here, and she is also a Suji volunteer from the Performing Artists Association. Okay, and、uh, you can see that Bilan is singing for the elderly, and.、Uh, All the elderly really expect really much because the singers will just go over there and sing for them, and this is what the like Suji Performing Artist Association are doing. Okay, and during the pandemic, okay, although COVID nineteen is a big problem, but they are still doing something. And Liang Bilan is now also a grandmother, and、uh, she says that as long as like、uh, mothers are happy, then this is enough. This is not not about giving money. Okay, money is just a number, but、uh, we can just spread the love to every people, every like elderly. And this is a good that we have a Suji Performing Artist Association with us here, right? And、uh, we really have to mobilize a lot of like performing artists, like、uh, whenever we have a kind of ceremony or like a shows, right? Okay. And、uh, she here are the actresses and the, like、uh, actors, right? And they are trying to mo- promote the recycling ideas, right? Okay. And、uh, they are all the actors and actresses that we know very well. And two of them are here with us today, right? <laughs> so take a look, right? This is what we need. And we are so touched. I'm happy.、Mm, this is the positive atmosphere that we have. And now, let's give our guest speakers a big hand. And we have a lot of touching stories of Xin Ciji, and it is full of happiness and joy. If you come over to Ciji, and you will just acquire very much, and you really acquire very much, you acquire really a lot, right? 
And because of the pandemic, I think I have to keep a kind of social distancing. Okay, right? We, okay. So only one of us, okay, can just have the privilege not wearing the masks, right? So who the first? And Nai Hua will be the first to get the speaker. So, ladies and gentlemen, Lin Nai Hua. Okay, thank you very much. I really learn much here in Shiji, right? And how about you? And do you also learn much here? And I really learn more than you and B. And how about you? Oh, more, more, more. More is not enough. I'm much more than you. All right. But this is not good. That let's not compare and let's not take issues over anything, right? But why do I say I learn more? Um, because you know I found the way of my life when I participated in Shiji, and Master Zheng Yan's preach really is useful to us, and which is seize the moment. And I have been in Shiji for eleven, right? And、uh, one one number one eleven right means like two ones right. And sorry, you know I can't just praise myself right. We have to shrink ourselves right. But that's okay. You can be confident with yourself. Of course, you know I'm very confident because I'm a Master Zhengyan's disciples right. I not only absorb a Master Zhengyan's dharma, but also I put them into action right. And last year, I also re re received the award of a Yi De Mother in Shiji Junior High School. I think this is a courage from Master Zhengyan that.、Uh, I have to seize the moment so that I can be honored so greatly, and I have to hold on to my initial aspiration and just keep doing. And if we can just carry all of them, and I think that everything's gonna be perfect. And before I was certified, I made my inspiration that I wanna be a Eid mother. And I also want to donate a million dollars as a donate as an honorary board member. And I also want to be the silent, like a silent mentor. But please don't be, give me the big hand so quickly. I have already, you know, finished two of my aspirations. But、uh, the final one is to be the silent mentor because you know I'm still standing here, so I can't do that right now. Well, and、uh, if we want to be the silent mentor, donating our body, and it also acquires requires like a positive affinity, right? So I think I want to say that we really have to hold on to every affinity that we can. We are blessed, so we trust it, and we carry the belief, and we do it. And like me, it's been the eleventh year as I. Was certified, right? And、uh, I was like awarded the,、uh, you know, the Cixi Mother like a certificate, right? And I felt very happy about that. And I now am sure that I am part of the big family of Cixi, right? Well, eleven years is not sure and not long, right? I felt very honored, right? And because of my persistence, so I'm here. I made like a three bows, right? And I have already like a make two of them, like a like like come true, right? Okay. And the final one is to be the silent mentor, and but I will keep working on my voluntary job, right? And.、Uh, We have、uh, a good woman, okay, and she is also my like a mentor, right? Okay, and、uh, and you know that you know in Taipei, and、uh, we have uh, like a Guangdu area, which is almost complete, right? And、uh, who donate? Who 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 is a donor? Okay, and number one is Wei Xinjuan. Wei Xinjuan means that she is、uh, so much willing to donate, right? And I really have to learn something from her, right? Okay, but Mister Chen Yin says that、uh, you carry the ability, you have the ability, and、uh, you do the thing, all right? So you have to do something, okay, based on your own capability, right? 
and、uh, Wei Xingjuan, who brought me to Ciji Junior High School for the first time,、uh, says that Cizong is really a special school. And I felt, oh my goodness, this is really, really different, right? Okay. Ever since I was born, I haven't seen such kind of perfect and beautiful school, right? Okay. And now I I can say you know kind 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 of beautiful. I have to say more than beautiful, right? And this is a great campus, and the teachers are so wonderful. And、uh, after that tour, I became more than you know confident to be a Eda mother. Well, and this is、uh, Wei Xingjuan because of her. So I had the affinity to be the Ciji, like a Ciji Eda mother. And then the second lady that、uh, was also my second、uh, like a manufacturer. Okay, is Median. Okay, and、uh, she wanted、uh, to recommend that I be the Ciji, like the Eden Mother in Ciji University, but、uh, I just immediately refused because you know I didn't have、uh, such kind of、uh, high educational ground, right? But the Median says as long as you are diligent, then you can just be this, right? Okay, right, okay, and every affinity I say that. Is good affinity, and the Buddha really just transform like a good people, right? And you know, Chen Su Fen, the hostess of、uh, guard of、uh, guardians of the land, right, on the ITV, and she also okay became the Yi the mother of Ciji Junior High School, and she is my good friend, and we are really close friend. And、uh, when we were like together, we never talk about the、uh, gossips, and、uh, we talk about Dharma of Master Zheng Yun all the time. And、uh, she acted、uh, in the I dramas as my daughter or my granddaughter, right? Okay. And、uh, she strongly recommended、uh, like a Ciji Junior High School to me if I wanna be the Ciji like a Yi the mother. Okay. And.、Uh, I still went to Thai Medin because you know she is our leader of our local community, and she also said the same thing strongly recommending Ciji Junior High School to me, right? Okay, and、uh, I became therefore the Eda mother in Ciji University. In the past,、uh, to my sons, and、uh, I just pointed very harshly to them, say it's time to study, time to do something. But after I just participated in Ciji Junior High School, I became so gentle and、uh, like a considerate, right? And、uh, we go to like a Ciji, I mean Ciji Junior High School, like a monthly as a like a Eda mother. And、uh, we are like very happy serving as、uh, like a Eda mother there. And、uh, okay, and I really have、uh, like a great affinities right with Chen Su Fen right. And、uh, we really talk about everything except the gossips right. And、uh, we went together on the train to Ciji Junior High School right. And you know that we are like、uh, perform artists, and we are superstars. So we had to wear makeups, and、uh, we had to wear like eyelash extensions, right? And、uh, we just you know, make up, and、uh, we became so beautiful at that time. And、uh, I wore makeup, and you know that I was also dressed in the Ciji uniform, right? Yeah. Okay. And now you see the different. Now I even didn't dye my hair, and then okay. And now my name is back into my real name, which is Lin Nai Hua. But when I was an actress on TV, okay, my name was Chiu Nai Hua, right? So everything I did is that I want to make myself pure into my true nature, right? And in the and I really want to do what Mister Zheng Yun wants to do, right? And therefore, the first thing is that I stop dyeing my hair, so you can see my gray hair right now. Okay, because you know I know that the dyeing hair really harms my 
eyes, right? And you know that wearing like eyelashes extensions really requires a lot of time, right? And、uh, whenever like、uh, masters from the jeans about the saw me wearing like、uh, eyelash extensions. And they say it's like, oh my God, right? Okay, you was just really like a ghost before, right? Okay, and now you are so different, right? Okay, so see how different I am, right? Okay, I really change a lot, right? Again, I want to go back to my true self in the pure self, right? And the Dharma really just get into myself, right? And I don't think that we can really live a wonderful life, right? Because there's nothing wonderful, perfect in the world. And what I wanna say, what I wanna talk about today is that, okay, if we transform our mind and our way of life, it would just change naturally, okay? And Chen Su Fen, okay, the hostess of the guardians of the land on the ITV. Just can't just go to like a Cici Junior High School on time monthly every month, and therefore she stopped being a Cici Yi 的 mother, and therefore I had to go to Cici Junior High School alone myself, and I felt so sad. And you know, the day before I had to go to Cici Junior High School, I just cried into tears, right? Okay, because you know I had to go alone to Cici Junior High School by myself, right? And、uh, nobody could、uh, just wear makeup for me, and nobody just can wear the、uh, eyelash extension for me. I felt、uh, so sad and lonely. And、uh, when I was on the train, I didn't feel like going anymore. Because you know, I had a little interaction with other volunteers, and I just cried into tears until I arrived in Huanian. However, I was in the Cici uniform, like Qi Pao. Therefore, as I arrived in Huanian, I just you know stop crying and just bear the negative feeling, and I gave myself a very very harsh smile. And then I step into the school. Why I felt so negative? Because you know Chen Su Fen who just left me alone, right? And、uh, she let me just go to like a Cici University by myself, right? Okay. And she is my inmate, and、uh, you know that how much I love her. Therefore, I just turn my love into hatred because I'm here in Tai in 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 Cici. Like a junior high school alone by myself, right? But one day, again, everything changed until I watched Mister Zheng Yuan preach. She says that if you are willing to do something, and nothing is difficult, and we have to seize the moment, and we have to cultivate our own wisdom. Nobody can just do this for you. And Master Zheng Yuan's preacher really gave me a big hit on my head, right? And it reminded me that oh yes, I had to seize every moment, right? Therefore, suddenly, in no time, I changed my mind. I transformed my like mindset, right? And、uh, I just continue doing the charity works, right, on my own, right? And it is that okay. I do everything, and I change my mind. So I got a positive ways now. Okay, and you have to really say thank you to Su Fen because you know because of it, and you can become more like、uh, you can like more like confident and stronger, right? Okay, and because of her absence, right, and you were on the train by yourself, right. So you had the time to just think and retrospect, like what you have done, all right. And ladies and gentlemen, see, okay, I didn't wear my makeup, my my makeup today, and I didn't wear my eyelash extension today. See, this is my true self, right? So I am so grateful for standing up here, right? Okay. So I also turn my mindset into positive one. And、uh, I now don't hate like Chen Su Fen now, and I don't wear makeup anymore, right? And I am not like a ghost anymore, right? Okay. And you know, Bi Lan is also a really good example and a bad example, right? And I wanted her to come over to Cici 
with me, rather she always say no to me, right? Okay, and it's been twenty years, right? Okay, and I have invited him to Ciji, you know, for twenty years, right? And originally you should have been senior to me in Ciji, but now you are junior to me, right? Okay, right, and, and now you are turn to talk, so I have to wear my mask and not wear yours, right? Okay. And actually, you know, I have been in Suji for over twenty years. Oh, I have to say, I have known Suji, not been in Suji for over twenty years, right? Okay. And actually, you know, I have been okay doing Suji charity works, right, with my mom. Okay, more than twenty years ago, right. Until I met my, I mean, elementary school classmates, right. So I had more chance to know more about Suji. And my classmate told me that okay, it was time that the Dalin Suji Hospital was ready to be built, right? And、uh, she just invited me to be her donating member, okay? And she knew that I was a singer, that I may make money, okay, kind of more money, okay? And、uh, she wanted me to be the donating member and、uh, sing the Suji song for Suji, right? And I just promised in no time, all right. And I said, okay, of course, right. And she also said, aside from singing, and would you like to participate in charity jobs, right? And doing something, okay, with her. And of course, that I said no because I had to wear the uniform. I hated the uniforms, right. And because you know I was without wisdom that time, right? You see this picture, you know I was dressed so beautifully in very colorful, like a like like a costumes, right? So I didn't want to wear you were like a Suji uniform. I hated that you were uniform, right? And so I like I had a lot of excuses, you know, for my like a classmate, right? And my excuses were always that I had to take care of my mother, and I got like a show recording on TV stations, right? So I just refused my classmate for many times, right? And she also said, "Fine, no problem." And、uh, you can also come to our year end、uh, like a ceremony, and it only like、uh, you can only just come every year yearly, right? And I say yes, but、uh, yes always means no, right? Because I never participated in any of the blessing ceremony. And、uh, you know that the year end blessing ceremony, okay, always like a takes place like, in the end of the year, right? Okay. And、uh, I had more excuses to say no for them because you know I had a lot of year end banquet and I had to sing for a, a lot of occasions, right? And because you know I enjoyed making money, right? And uh, and uh, when I see like money just you know run by, okay, and I felt so sad, so I had to get I had to get all the money that I wanted, right? Okay. Therefore, I rejected the all the year end ceremony, all the charity jobs, right? And but one last time, I felt you know I just couldn't you know say no, okay, anymore, right? Because you know the classmate just told me exactly the date, and on that date, okay, and she just you know just call me. Okay, they they, but you know, you think that this is the last chance. I say no, sorry, I still said no. All right, because I just didn't want to participate that. But once, you know, the time came, right? Okay, my classmate just called me and said, "Bilan, where are you?" I said, "I am home." Right, and she said, "Are you free today?" Yes, I'm free today. And when I say I'm free. And、uh, my classmate said, "Okay, wonderful. You are free, so I will go to you. Go to me for what? Okay, for the year and the ceremony because you say you are free today, right? Okay. Oh my God, I was caught, right? Okay. And now it is one o'clock, and the year and ceremony begins at one thirty. So I will go over to your home and、I、take you to Jin Si Ho, right? And for the year and the ceremony, right? Oh my God, I felt so." Unhappy, right? Okay, but I still go. I still went to the year end ceremony reluctantly, right? Okay, and as I enter the stadium, and、uh, I just wanted to go home because another excuse just came up to my mind. I said, 
Yeah, it's a full of people. It's a crowded. They are must be like a no seat for me. So I really think I had to go home. My classmates say, "Come on, although it is crowded, but there must be some seat for you, right? Okay. So let's patiently find a seat. There must be somewhere that we can sit, right? Okay. Don't miss up the wonderful chance, right? Okay. And therefore, I just saw so many seats, right, available, like a.、Uh, For us, right, and, and I say that I don't want to sit, you know, in the middle of somewhere. I just want to take the side seat, right, because you know I could just go and、uh, go home very easily, right? Okay, so therefore I found a side seat, and、uh, as I sat down, finally, and I just. Didn't know. I just couldn't understand why so many people wanted to come to such a boring thing here.、Right? And as the light turned dark, and we had we we see like a two like a big screaming like a big screams on the stage, and、uh, I therefore saw Mister Zheng's image, but I just couldn't help but cried. My tear just came over my eye, like nonstop. But I just didn't know why I cried. Why? Why my tear just came over endlessly, un nonstop, right? And、uh, I, I just didn't know. I, I just failed that, and、uh, because I, I was a superstar, you know that, and I just failed to kind of embarrass because you know I cried in public. And after everything ended, after Master Zheng's preach ended, my tears stopped. But I just didn't know that. Okay, I didn't leave any moment until the ceremony ended. But I just felt weird that you know I felt super happy that day. As if my burden had been just released that day, and my classmates just say to me that, "Come on, I just wanted you to come over, but you just rejected me for more than a thousand times there, and now you are, you are fastened to be one of Master Zheng's disciples, right? And therefore, and did you come over to Ciji? Did you get into Ciji? No, sorry. Come on, this is ridiculous, right? It was so difficult to be transformed, right? Okay." Right. Okay. Because you know, you know that I didn't want to come to Ciji because I had to wear the uniform, and I really hated the your uniform there. Right. Everybody looks good when they are in Ciji's uniform, but I don't look good. You know, right? Okay. If, you know my body shape. You know that my body shape, and I look like a sausage. Right. So how is my body shape? Right. My body shape is really, really like a like a. Like, like a chubby, right? Okay, and I, I really, yeah. See, see, my body shape with the like, with the look like a, just like a sausage, like a walking sausage. If I am in your city uniform, right? Don't you think so? Okay, right. See, well, and, and think, right? I am a superstar. I am a performing artist, and I must be dressed beautifully. And this is what a superstar should look like, right? So how could it be possible that I am dressed in USG uniform, which make me look like a sausage, right? So, so I I said to my classmate, okay, can I just be a donating member, collecting fund, right? And、uh, she said, sure, you can do this, right? So, ladies and gentlemen, you know that、uh, I just cried in tears, right, in the year-end ceremony, and I have collected the donations for over twenty years, right. But、uh, the real chance came over seven years ago, when I really, really had a chance to have my fortune told. And、uh, the fortune teller said, right, okay, told me that, yeah, Bilan. And I think、uh, you are kind of a yeah monastic cut. You need to be a monastic like a practitioner, right? Practitioner, and、uh, you really have to do good deeds and、uh, do some charity jobs, which is good for your destiny, right? And、uh, when I heard this, I felt so sad. I said, "Can can my destiny be changed?" And the fortune teller said to me, "No, 
No, you can, all right. And you really had to change your bad habits into good ones, and do charity works, and do good deeds as a monastic practitioner, right? Okay, right. And therefore, I reluctantly turned on the TV, listening to Master Zheng Yan's preach, and and.、Uh, But I also learned that okay, I have to change okay my habitual tendencies, and、uh, as long as I listen to the Dharma, and I have to put the Dharma into actions and、uh, do good things, right? And the Master Zheng Yan on TV also said urgently says it's too late, it's too late, right? Okay. And the fortune teller also told me that it's too late for me. Okay, if I don't do good deeds as a monastic practitioner, but I still had so many excuses, right? Okay, and my excuse was always that I had to take care of my mother. But seven years ago, my mother just passed away, so I thought to myself that I had a normal excuse, right? So I said, well, all right. It was year twenty twenty fifteen, so I finally came into Ciji, and I received the training program for the first year. And、uh, when I was、uh, like a trained volunteer, and、uh, my family member, my daughter agreed. Okay, and、uh, and my daughter said to me that okay, mother, okay, you you have、uh, like a bad feet, you got a feet problem, but if you became the Ciji volunteer, you had to walk very, very, very much, right? So how can you choose the time to be trained as a volunteer, right? Oh yeah, but but、uh, I. Said to my daughter that if I don't walk when I can now, and if I don't serve when I can serve now, okay, I, 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 when should I should should I wait until I can walk right? But you can see that okay, now you are walking so well, right? And it was just not like what you were worried about. You have got a healthy body, of course, you got a healthy feet, right? Okay. And I got injured when I was filming the drama, right? Okay. And、uh, now my problem is that I I couldn't kneel down and I just couldn't stand too long. So I think the only great thing for me is that I didn't just perform the sutra. Okay. Right. Okay. So I I think. I I I can run, but not long, right? So this is enough for me, all right? Because you know, at least I can do a lot of like a Ciji charity jobs, right? Okay. And I think I'm lucky that I enter the Ciji like a big family here. And of course, right? If you change your mind, then everything changes, right? And if I didn't change my mind, then how could I have the chance? To stand here and share my experience in online study group Gaosheng. Thank you, and this is a chance to give us right. Thank you, thank you, Teacher Mei Yun. And I think you know we have to wear the masks right here. Well, okay, you don't need to wear the mask because we have two of us wearing the masks, right? Okay, and、uh, we have Ying Ying. Okay, she is also a performing artist in Ciji Performing Artist Association, and she is a volunteer in Taipei. And this is a she that called me, okay, to participate in the year end ceremony, and、uh, she invited me to go. And、uh, I also recommended this good chances to more than one performing artist, and which is Su Yue. Okay, so we had so many people going to the year end ceremony in Taipei together, and this is Ying Ying. And I'm so grateful that every year that we have for this chance to listen to like a performing artist sharing every year right here, right. And whenever we have、uh, like a performing artist coming here, and I feel this is wonderful because you know, everyone is a wonderful actress here because you see them on TV really frequently, 
and they can say something, and they of course also do something in Ciji. And and Chiyo, you can come over, please. And actually, and when we see their interaction and the fun talk here, and we know that we can find their pure mind, and this is true. This is a truth which cannot be hid, hidden. And、uh, I think what is precious is that they always hold on to their like initial aspirations, even now, right? And their pure mind is the most precious thing here, right? And this is a very fun, and this is a very touching too, right? And may I say something, Mei Yun? And、uh, Yi Ying is a volunteer now back in Kaohsiung, but、uh, she served in Taipei before. And I told her that、uh, as you are back in Kaohsiung and that you have to do more, okay, in Kaohsiung, right? You can't stop doing any Ciji jobs, right? This is what I said to her, right? Okay. And I'm so grateful, and I'm so touched. Thank you, thank you, thank you 